everybody, as we're getting started, we are at pin one, checking out the Duroc gilts. All right, let's just start with the gilt here on the far left. 8-7. Okay, that is 8-7. Eight dash eight. 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 Sorry, that is lot eight. Eight is lot eight is eight dash eight. Forefront paradise. I think this gilt had. I mean, she. What I love about her is her massive skull width, but yet from there back she's still plenty green in her body condition. She sets that hind leg in really great. For Durox, you know, it, it is never a problem when they have room to grow and that massive chest floor makes me think that, that she's just going to get thicker, wider, bolder. She's level in her hip, really good in her hind leg, just a super complete gilt. Um, I love her pedigree, you know, Forefront was the sire of the 210,000 world record setting boar from Louisville last year. Paradise is a Duroc boar that we had here that just fundamentally gave us the best feet and legs. So kind of the stoutness. Not to mention she's tall shouldered and big legged, Lindsay. Absolutely. Here's the little 13 gill. All right, 13-3, lot 10, family tradition survivor. Remember, she's a little younger than the rest of these. Um, and I know she's a little smaller than those in the pen, but whoo-hoo, she is cocky. This girl, she is heads up, full bladed, fresh back. She has great muscle expression and shape down her top. This is a girl who just needs to go home, have a little TLC, grow this one out. She'll be an absolute fun one to have this summer. An easy uh, one to try and get that head cranked up. She's locked 10. Okay, so let's go with the two dash uh, seven gilt right okay. here, Lynn. Right here, two dash seven. She is locked seven. Redbone Southern Knight. I want to take a second and study her. She is for sure the alpha female of this pen. She demands attention. She demands, uh, she pushes the others out of the way. A, side note, great showmanship pig when they do that. But study that bone work. Study how tall shouldered she is, but yet big back. She is the one who can bind extra extension with mass and squareness. I love how she is. Here's her sister right here we go. Two dash five. Her sister is a uh, lot six. Remember that pedigree is red bone Southern Knight. Her sister is just a not shorter body as you can tell, but she packs in even more bone. Um, and, and again, that's what you get when you breed with red bone. These red bone females are foundation type sows. Big skull, big bladed, stout, massive girl. I think she comes in, she looks like a horse. You're gonna have a lot of fun with her. If we can find eight 10. Right here she comes. She is lot nine. This is again a forefront paradise. Just like the other gilt, this girl is green. She's a little younger, and she, you know, maybe she has been pushed out of the way by the others. But what a fancy gilt! I think this is one that she will look ten, you know, just keep getting better and better, and look better in your barn uh, as she masses up. But what a front end! Look how clean fronted she is. That long stride off of that front blade, really expressive and fancy. She's just a really cool, neat. Lindsay, girl. this one's head, neck set, her ear set off to the side, her length of stride mm -hmm. is going to differentiate her from the rest of the crowd. Okay. Absolutely. There we go. Good job. 